Hey guys, welcome back to Wigging Out. Thank you for stopping by for another review today. Today I have for you a unit by Made Beauty. This is Tiana. I have her in the color AB530. Now I'm just showing you the cap construction here. So it is a lace part wig. There's no lace to cut. Two combs in the front, a comb in the back, and the adjustable straps. Now this is a very easy short unit as you can see. Um, the only complaint I really had about this unit was I do not like filler hairs. And as you can see, it does have that little hump in the bang to give it that full look it's just not for me so later on in the video you will see that i did use my blow dryer to um, flatten it down just a little bit and i just did a few minor tweaks to it to make it look a little more natural for me i like my hair on my shorter units behind my ear or where my ear shows i shall say if that makes any sense so you will see that I made it so that my ear will show. I don't like that look of the short units with just this little piece of hair hanging over your ear. To me, it's just not my style. Now, I do love the way the back of the unit is cut. It looks very natural how it gradually comes down into a taper opposed to some of the other short units that are like all the same length in the back. You know what I'm saying? Like there's no dimensions to it. So for me, I really love the cut. I love the little piece of color in the front. And it's just an easy and simple unit. Now, the only thing I did was I pulled a few hairs out of the front of the parting space, added my finishing powder or my face powder, I shall say, and clipped the, um, the right side a little bit. Now it is a right side part. So I did go ahead and trim that down just a little bit to make it look more natural. And other than that, that was it now guys i purchased this unit from ebonylines.com so if you guys are interested in tiana by made beauty i will leave all the purchasing information in the description box now guys while you're here please don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you stay with me for this two minutes two minutes we've been here already you might as well go ahead and hit the subscription button now I also added a little dry shampoo because she had a little bit of shine and as you can see it gives you that white cast so I went in with my Demute wig spray just to get rid of that white cast in the wig but I don't really like that shine and the darker wigs do tend to have that little shine to it so the dry shampoo helped. Now, I'm done with my rambling guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. Now also I do want to say I recorded this week, this review last week and I'm just now getting around to editing due to my work schedule, guys. They are killing me at work with this Christmas season, but it's almost over. So I will be more consistent in bringing more reviews <laughs> until next time, guys. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see ya.